All right. Currently in Los Angeles, California, and I am about two days from moving into my apartment and really starting my college experience. But we'll get back to all of that at a later stage. For the past couple months, I've experienced a lot of growth and coming of age within my life. And I thought it was a great idea to document it and put it into like a little bit of a web series before I get into creating the videos that I've always dreamed of, of being in college. Think of these as like a precursor to all of that. So without further ado, this is part one. Autonomy, the right or condition to have self-governance over yourself. This is something that I've always wanted for a long period of my life. The idea is to be able to control what happens to myself in my life has always been very important to me. Because of COVID, I felt that as though I had lost the chance to be independent and be on my own. I wanted to stretch myself and push myself outside my boundaries. To have full confidence in myself that I can handle myself and most of my needs. With that said, I booked a trip to Seattle. <laughs> off at the airport. Alright, so we made it to SF but to find where the gate was, but now I have about an hour and a half to like chill for my connecting flight leaves. So. Alright, so it's a Seattle. One of my bucket list things was to see Mount Rainier out of the airplane and that actually happened. It's just kind of like surreal to me. That was crazy. So now I gotta take the light. I think it's called the light rail. Um, about like 40 minutes to my buddy's house. So I just rode in that train for like 40 minutes. I got on the right. I got on the right one. I got on the right one. Um, so now we're at Capitol Hill. No surprise at how deep on their ground we were. And also like I paid for this thing, this walker thing, and like I don't even know if I had to, like spam it anymore. I don't know. I don't know if thing works. Thirty minute walk turned into almost an hour because I went the wrong way. <laughs> I literally passed his place. <laughs> Kept walking. But yeah, we are. We're here. Oh my god. Out of breath. We made it though. Oh my clothes are super sweaty and drenched, so time to change it after that. Much better. So apparently upstairs they have a really nice patio. Oh my god. Holy crap. Oh, that's a view and a half. Next couple of days can be pretty fun. All right, so finally kind of free to do whatever I want now. I just took like a little, like 10 minute power nap. I slept maybe about two, two hours. So I'm definitely gonna knock out tonight. Hopefully I don't get too jet lagged so I don't lose some time tomorrow goal now is to take one of these like I don't know if I can get that big if I can get that thing that'd be pretty nice but apparently these are like, scooter things and I'm pretty good with scooters I think like, when I was in college like maybe like how many months ago like I feel like that was a whole lifetime ago I had a scooter and I was scootering around everywhere so I feel pretty comfortable on those so I'm probably gonna go find one of those I think I'm gonna get some food and go sightseeing and maybe take some photos you can see on the app I'm here it's blue dot and I'm trying to get to the scooter which is right over there there's the beauty Okay, here we go. So good so far, on the scooter, let's go. <laughs> it's kind of cheap. I, expected, I thought it was gonna be more expensive, but it's pretty good. Damn, I need, oh, I can use this as a free viewer? Oh, I'm kind of sick. All right, let's not, let's cut my. Turn left onto East Pine Street. All right, it was like total of like six bucks. It's pretty good. Now we're back at the Capitol Hill station and within like, I think it took me, it took me like five minutes to get there with the scooter. I'm like so confused at how that system works. Is it like honor system? I don't know what's going on. Also, I have glasses inside. <laughs> right now we're in the city. What the heck? Oh my gosh, this is so cool. I mean, it's just a bunch of buildings and like rocks and things, but. Yeah.
right. Time to eat. Oh my gosh, this is so good. Well, anyways, cut in half because I don't know if I need the whole thing. I say something there, but. I'm about to undergo one of the most touristy attractions in Seattle. The Space Needle. Oh my god. Not gonna lie, I'm kind of excited for this. Some pretty cool views, like probably the best views I'm gonna see here. But ooh. right on schedule, there she is. All right, so I managed, so I managed to scooter my way to the REI store, but I am now waiting for a special guest. Oops. I'm so tired. It's been a long day so far. I was vlogging the whole day. Young is back. <laughs> I'm back. Hi, vlog. Going around the first day was awesome. And I got to experience new places that I've never seen before. And, and I was finally able to feel that sense of autonomy. With that said, please make sure to like, comment, subscribe, hit that subscriber icon if you haven't already, and ring the bell for notifications. You guys already know the deal. But I'll see you guys when I see ya. Shoots. <laughs>